is in the air a bit, and you will soon see the proof. The colors are already starting to pop in some spots. WBZ meteorologist Sarah Robleski shows us what to expect this season. We think it's going to be a pretty bright year. Mother Nature is known to put on an incredible show of colors all across New England every fall. But it's the seasons before that can determine how vibrant the colors will be. It goes all the way back to last winter and spring. Uh, we had a fairly wet spring, and then through the summer we had adequate moisture, a good growing season, not many bugs, not much in the way of uh, fungus and mold. The leaves are healthy, and uh, we think it's going to be a good fall because of that. The leaves are already starting to change in some parts of New England, and with above average temperatures expected through October, that could have an impact on the foliage season. Yeah, already the colors are coming in up north. Uh, they've had some frosts, and because of that, the colors have really kick-started. Uh, further south where it stayed warmer and will stay longer warmer, uh, we expect the, temp the, the temperatures to hold that foliage back a bit. It's also a mast year for our forests, meaning a lot of trees are producing a bumper crop of acorns and maple seeds. If trees put their energy into producing seeds, they're not producing as big or as many leaves. So the trees are healthy, but a little thin this year. And while gypsy moths are not an issue this year due to the wet spring, there is another kind of moth that could impact the foliage this season. A lot of people have been seeing those cool spiky caterpillars this year, those little tussock moths. Uh, they're attacking the young oaks right now. They usually hit late enough in the year that they don't cause damage to trees, but some of the young oaks are losing some leaves right now, and that'll impact foliage a bit. Not to worry, though. About every place in New England will have a three-week window of spectacular foliage. The colors are going to be bold, uh, so we're expecting a normal year, and a normal year in New England is spectacular. In Bedford, New Hampshire, I'm meteorologist Sarah Robleski, WBC News. And you wouldn't think so with the weather, but I have started to notice some pops here and there. It's coming. And it happens overnight to some trees that you know well. Those colder think, nights, I think, make the big difference. What if that happened all of a sudden? <laughs>